After spending an amazing few days in Tromso where we got to check off some major bucket list items, we decided to escape the big city and head for the little fishing town of Samaroy. The drive was a short two hours and of course no drive would be complete in Norway without seeing a few reindeer along the side of the road. Samaroy is an incredibly beautiful town with water as blue as the Caribbean and the most beautiful snow-capped mountains you will ever see. Now it's time to show you guys around this wonderful place. Welcome to Samaroy! We took a quick shuttle this morning. It was about an hour from our hotel in Tromso to get to this wonderful fishing island of Samaroy. We paid a little bit extra to take a shuttle from our hotel in Tromso to the hotel here. If we took the public bus, it would have been cheaper, but we wanted to get as much daylight as possible in because you don't get very much in the winter. Here is the outside of our hotel, but we're gonna go inside really quick and give you guys a room tour, and then we're gonna come back out here to do some exploring. It is time to give you guys a room tour of our hotel here at Samurai Arctic Hotel, which is actually the only hotel in Samurai. So, we start out with, we have two beds. We're not cuddling tonight, but at least this hotel gave us two separate comforters. Our last hotel only gave us one, and these are like individual comforters. We got a nice little desk here. This is so nice for working so we don't have to work on the bed. We've got a comfy chair over here. So comfy. Oh, I think I'm gonna be working here. This chair is like so plush. But the best part is for sure our view of Samurai. We've got some snow-capped mountains in the back. We got snow-capped mountains over there. Oh, this place is beautiful. And now for the most exciting part of the tour, the bathroom. Actually, I haven't even been in here yet. Nice, we got a big shower. Ooh, this is a very large shower, that's nice. It's very clean in here. Now let's go explore Samurai. There's a cute little beach! I've heard that the water here in Samurai almost looks like the Caribbean, so I'm excited to see it. This is so beautiful. I don't think I've ever been at a beach before when there's snow-capped giant mountains in the back. Of course it's insanely cold out here, so it makes sense that there's snow, but it's just so peaceful to watch the water just wash up on the sand. This water is so clear. For some reason when I think about the Arctic, I don't think that they would have clear water, but this is like so, like it really does look like the Caribbean. I know Jenny is probably gonna try to convince me to do a polar plunge here, but there is no way. <laughs> it is too cold for that. We'll save that for another video, but we're for sure doing a polar plunge here. We did one in Iceland. We did a snow roll in Finland. So I just think it's fair that we have to do something in Norway too. Not gonna lie, it's really tempting me. I really wanna be like snorkeling right now. Only I wish it was a little bit hotter. Wow, this is just so beautiful. Look at that bright blue water contrasted with the snow-capped mountains. Oh, this place is a dream. And I should have worn gloves. <laughs> They're really cold. Wow. It is super windy here. In Tromso, it wasn't really too windy. Of course, when we were on the boat, it was windy. But whenever you get by the ocean, the sea breeze just takes you along. But it really does. I just love the smell of like the salty ocean. And you can definitely smell it here.
to cross the water, we had to walk across this bridge. The cars have to stop these red lights because it's only wide enough for one way traffic, but we can just walk across whenever we want. And then over here, I think we have Samurai's only restaurant. I say only restaurant because this is the only thing that came up on Google Maps when I searched for restaurants. Of course, our hotel also has a restaurant, so it kind of counts. I would be interested to find out if there was anything else, but I really don't think so. We aren't gonna eat here yet. I'm sure we will at some point on this trip, but right now we are gonna head to the market to see what they have. here at the market and I'm pretty sure it's closed because it's dark in there and there's no one else around. Yep, looks closed. If my Norwegian is correct, they have hours for Monday through Thursday, for Friday and Saturday, but today is Sunday, so it's closed. Well, I guess we're gonna have to find food somewhere else. And just like there's only one hotel and one restaurant, there is only one market, so we're gonna just have to come back another day. Of course we knew this coming into it. We knew that it was going to be a very small town here in Samurai, and this is pretty much what you should expect. We, of course, we like the bigger cities because of the amenities that they have. You can go to pretty much any restaurant you want, any grocery store, it'll pretty much always be open when you want it to be. But a smaller place like this, you just get to experience it and it's still fun. I mean, it's fun just walking around here, getting to explore this small little area. And yeah, if something's closed, yeah, oh well, you just come back a different time. My face is so frozen, oh my gosh. And it's actually only this side because this is the side that the wind was hitting. This side's like numb, but this side is like, oh yeah can't feel that at all. As we're walking around the town, it's cool to see all of the houses here. They're just like all spread out. Nobody's like too close to each other. They have their spot of land. I really like that. It, I don't know exactly how many people live here, but it can't be that many. We are back at our hotel to warm up a little bit before we go back outside, but they have free coffee and tea, so I'm gonna get some coffee. We definitely saved the best view right now. We're getting lunch inside, but I want to show you around our hotel because it is stunning out here. Well, first they have this little gym, but it overlooks this incredible view. So maybe Jacob and I will finally get to the gym. Oh my gosh, that's a bar? What? That is so cute. There's a little bar out there. I don't think it's open right now, but maybe in the summertime it is. That's so fun. Okay, look at this incredible view. Oh, just look at how beautiful this is. Sorry, the sun is setting. It's only one o'clock, but look at this. Oh my gosh, and the water is still so blue here. Also, that's definitely where Jacob and I are gonna do our polar plunge in another video. And then this is the main hotel. Jacob is right there ordering us food. We're getting fish and chips, or at least I am. This place is just so wonderful. We even have our own little beach right here. I know that Samurai is a super tiny town, but I just love tiny towns. It makes my heart sing. I love just being out here in nature, not having to deal with rushing cars, like in the city. Like it's just so peaceful out here. Oh, I'm just so happy we're in Samurai. Now let's go get some hot, delicious fish and chips because your girl is freezing. And now we are warming up back inside, but we still have a beautiful view out there. So it's a lot better because we're warm and we have a beautiful view instead of being freezing and having a beautiful view. I got a glass of wine. It is quite expensive here. We paid like 40, $50 for all of this, I think. 56, yeah. We paid $56 for two meals and a glass of wine. 
but it is to be expected because we are in the middle of nowhere and they have to get all the food here and we have beautiful views, so it's fine. Thank you. I have been craving fish and chips ever since we got here because I just feel like it's gonna be so fresh from the sea right there. Oh, I'm so excited for this and it's so warm. I'm just gonna like put my hands above it. Mm, this is why I need them. Here we go, the first bite. It is literally so crispy on the outside and then so soft and warm on the inside. I think this is the best fish and chips I have ever had in my entire life. Look at that, it's so good. Oh, okay, I've never tried pea sauce before. It's mashed peas. Yeah, it tastes like peas, just mashed up. <laughs> but this burger, I really hope it was worth the price. Oh my gosh, that looks huge. It's pretty big. <laughs> okay, so bacon, cheese, meat, lettuce, tomato, onion. There's some mayonnaise here too. Is it better than Burger King? <laughs> we had a lot of Burger King in Tromso. Yes, of course it's better. It is more expensive too, but I mean, I'll still enjoy this. We're done with our lunch. It is 2 p.m. and it's completely dark outside. We're hoping to see the northern lights while we're here in Samurai. And if we saw them tonight, we'll cut to that right now. And if we didn't see them tonight, then we hope that you stay tuned for more Samurai videos and the rest of our world travels. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you later.